may remember staining slides in biology class, dipping them in red and purple dyes to reveal microscopic structures. Pathologists use similar techniques to diagnose diseases like cancer. But now, researchers have developed a new type of microscope slide, one that uses nanotechnology to change the color of cells and reveal cancers without any staining at all. The slides, called Nano-M slides, work using electrons embedded on their surface that wiggle or oscillate when they're hit with a beam of light. As light from a microscope passes through a piece of tissue, the specific characteristics of that tissue cause the electrons to react in different ways, and that changes the color. We create a pattern across the entire slide, which basically makes the surface into a, a type of sensor. Um, so your entire microscope slide then becomes a sensor. And depending on what gets put on that sensor, different wavelengths of the ambient light are absorbed. So if, um, for example, I put a healthy cell on, on our sensor, it absorbs a certain set of wavelengths. And if you take a, a cancer cell and you place it on this, this sensor, it will absorb a different set of wavelengths because its composition is slightly different. The researchers aren't entirely sure what it is about the cancer cells that makes them show up in different colors. It could be the density of proteins within the cell, something about the cell's skeleton, or the way its contents are organized. In this example, normal cells turn yellow and breast cancer cells turn green. And that could allow for quick, accurate diagnoses that could be vital in the treatment of diseases like breast cancer. More and more women are being diagnosed with really early stages of breast cancer, for example. More women are getting biopsies um, to, to really look, do they actually have cancer or you know, an earlier stage or a benign abnormality? In a standard cancer screen, biopsied tissue taken from the breast must be embedded in wax, sliced very thin, then placed on a slide and stained. Usually a pathologist may be looking at a subtle change in the shape of a cell um, amongst a tissue of, of thousands or millions of cells. And, you know, this nanoslide was really picking up a difference in a cancer cell compared to another early sort of change in these cells. By eliminating the staining step, the Nano-M slides produced clear and accurate results in as little as 10 minutes. It was quite amazing that we could just see these cancer cells uh, through a conventional microscope, so a normal microscope, um, we can really distinguish these cancer cells from, from other surrounding cells, including the very cells that uh, cancer arises from. Nano-M slides probably won't be a replacement for other diagnostic methods, but they could provide one more tool to help pathologists standardize their diagnoses of diseases, which can sometimes be difficult to call. We see that this, this, this work is really being the tip of the iceberg. There are um, other disease states and other cancers, in fact, that we are um, also pursuing as well. And in the meantime, the researchers say that knowing immediately whether a tissue is cancerous or not could help surgeons decide which sections of a tumor to remove. It's time critical, you know, the patient's lying on the table. You need to get a, the, the, the surgeon and the pathologist want to get a result as quickly as possible to minimize the amount of time that the patient is under. And these slides, because of the fact that they don't require any chemistry in terms of the staining or labeling, could have a huge positive impact, I think, in that, in that setting.